starring Rachel Cummins, and I'm fighting Michelle Gutierrez on October 25th, and uh, I'm really excited. My first experience was my amateur, and um, I didn't have very much experience, but when I first went in that cage, I felt, I just, I felt really comfortable, and knowing that that was the first experience, it's usually supposed to be the most scary part, and since it's my pro fight going in there again, I'm so excited because it just, I don't know, I feel like it's like at home. You know, I have all my friends and family there, and then you know all the promoters, and I just, it's like family almost, you know? So it's gonna feel really comfortable. Well, I really like fighting for Nama. Um, it just the whole venue is really nice. It's really organized. Um, it's, um, it's very professional. Every, the whole weigh-ins, everything goes smoothly, and everything just goes really smooth. And you know, I've had other promotions where it's not quite as smooth, and Nama, I'm just really excited. I like them a lot. <laughs> My pro debut, I lost on a decision, and I had a horrible weight cut, and um, you know, it wasn't the best performance, I wasn't happy with it at all, and um, I think that she just thinks that maybe I'm not really that dangerous, but in reality I could be extremely dangerous, and uh, I think that if people just watch my first amateur fight at Bama, <laughs> they'll kind of see what, like, what I'm kind of capable of, so I mean, I just think that um, you know, I, I haven't had that much experience, so sometimes people think that, you know, I don't really like to get punched in the face, I just want to go to the ground or whatever, but reality, I learn every day, I get better every single day, and I work my ass off every day, too. So that's the difference between other people, is that I work here every day, it's a job to me, and um, I mean, I do double days every day. I mean, I think I work harder than a lot of girls. I've been training this whole time at Brain Training Center. Um, this is where I first started my jiu-jitsu career without even thinking I was ever going to become an MMA fighter. Just thought I was going to be a jiu-jitsu person and Rain just really, um, you know, got me ready for it. And um, I'm also training at Spider Muay Thai and um, that's getting my hands a lot better. <laughs> so um, I have really good coaches. My focus is just uh, making sure that I'm staying healthy and um, you know, taking my vitamins. I'm in here every single morning. I'm keeping my body healthy. I'm going to the fight doco see. He's keeping me really healthy and um, you know, eating right um, and just keeping my mind really focused. The main thing is mentally. So if you're not mentally there, then it's all over. That's the most important part all the time. I think that um, the transition for my amateur career, for my pro, even though I didn't have the best amateur career, I was starting, you know, I jumped in there really fast and had much experience, but, you know, I, I, I went with a lot of good girls. I had Courtney Casey, I had um, Jenny Liu, I had um, Christy Lopez. They all had a lot of experience, way more experience than I ever had. And, um, you know, with fighting them and going three rounds, you know, with Courtney Casey, Courtney Casey is really good. You know, a lot of people will just fight, you know, Joe Schmoes and, you know, they get a win. But, you know, at least I know that, you know, when I did lose, that I didn't have much experience and that I still fought one of the best girls. And that to me, I felt like, I mean, that's the most improvement I could have done was learning myself from those fights. That my first amateur fight when I had it with you guys, I just, I felt just like an animal. I looked like an animal in the cage. Like literally I was in a cage just looking like an animal. <laughs> and um, I really want to, um, be an animal in this fight too. I'm very excited that we're the first pro female fight on the card. Um, you know, it's always good to be the first anything, you know. Um, I probably get some more exposure when you're the first of anything for any anywhere. And um, I don't know, I'm really excited. I, I feel that um, having all my friends and family there, I'm gonna be really pumped and I'm just, I'm gonna be an animal. That's all I have to say. Well, Michelle does have a really good, really big fan base. Um, I mean, I think that she had one of the most fans originally because she was one of the originals. There wasn't a lot of MMA girls before. And um, I knew of her before I started, before I had my first amateur. So I knew that, um, you know, I knew she was a really good boxer. I've seen her fight before. I've seen her fight Felice Herrick. I've seen her fight, you know, she's a known girl. So a win over her, which is really put me in the ranks, I think. You know, a lot of people would actually be like, oh, you know. This girl knows how to fight. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm really excited. I'm, this is the most exciting fight I've ever been excited for. <laughs> They're going to expect a really good show. And I'm very creative, so whenever you think that there's something, there might be a different change. 
So, um, so uh, they'll be surprised. I want to shout out to my big sponsor. Um, it's here, TV Zone. And, um, you know, Fight fight Dog OC, that's, um, they've been keeping me healthy every time. I mean, without them, I don't know. <laughs> and then I have also have OTM. And then, um, what else am I? I have Tussle. That's one. <laughs> and then I think that is all I have. And then um, Rain Training Center and Spider Muay Thai. And that's it. <laughs> this is Rachel Cummins, and I fight Michelle Gutierrez on October 25th at Commerce Casino for Bama USA.